Hello YouTube, Robert here. Uh, welcome to another episode of Drive Home Fishing Talk. Uh, today's subject I wanted to go over uh, canoes and paddle boats. Um, I haven't fished off of a canoe. I never have done that, but I am thinking about investing in getting one. And I would just like to hear about your uh, experiences fishing on a canoe or whatnot. Uh, I have a lot of plans for it. Uh, I'm I'm making sure I can get I'm getting one that is really strong, which you know it can't tip over very easily. That's what I'm I'm in the market of getting. But my plan for a canoe is going to be going down the Jordan River in the springtime, summertime, and dropping an anchor out there and just. Uh, and be able to paddle too to a different location or where the water seems to be moving a lot slower and stuff places where you can't get to because uh, there's just no way to fish it off the shore so uh, that's my plans and then on the paddle boat I was also thinking about getting a paddle boat too I mean there's this one it's made by uh, Sun Dolphin is the name of the company that makes it it can fit five people. I don't see how it could, but it says it can fit five people. Weight capacity is 800 pounds, or eight, 875. The canoe, what I was also thinking about getting, the canoe is, the weight capacity is 800 pounds. And then the paddle boat's 875. So I'm in the toss up of what I want to get. Uh, the canoe is going to run me close to $700 and then if I wanted to go with the paddle boat that's going to run me only $545 $545 so so two things uh, feel free to share your experiences on small watercraft and your successes on using them and out there and fishing in them and then also uh, Give me what you think is a better uh, for my style of fishing. Like, I think it'd be a lot easier. A paddle boat might be a lot easier to get around. But I'm also thinking about mounting it because I, I have a Ford Explorer, which is capable of pulling a trailer, but I've never seen a paddle boat with a trailer. Uh, you know, someone pulling a trailer with a paddle boat on the back of it. So. And that's why I was thinking about a canoe because it'll be easier to mount on the roof of my car. Uh, yeah, let me know which which one you think I should get. Um, I'm 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 hoping this by next summer I'll have it. If not, I'll have to put it off for next Christmas. But uh, so yeah, feel free to leave comments on your experience in both of those small crafts if you have done it, and feel free to leave a comment stating on which one I should get. Alright, uh, thanks for watching YouTube. Uh, feel free to check out all my other Drive Home Fishing Talk videos in the description below of my Drive Home Fishing Talk trailer. You can look at that. Uh, that trailer is located on my channel under Drive Home Fishing Talk videos and you can look at all my videos that way too. Um, like if you like, subscribe if you want, or have a good one YouTube.